Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the cabana. What the fuck? Whoa! Oh, you bastards! I sound like that racist mouse from Looney Tunes! You know, I just gotta beg the question, how did these prisoners escape a prison facility? And... Where did they get the... Army military... Vehicle of death? Huh. <sighs> oh, and these guys respawn if you kill them. Uh, during a specific time, so... Yeah. Anyways, these were the guys I was talking about that would appear, and they're a pain in the ass! Either they try to run you over, hit you with that bat, or shoot you. They'll mainly try to shoot you because their driving sucks. Hello, Travis, you're on candid camera again. Anyways, we want to find Sophie here, and get her out as fast as possible while also trying to eliminate those psychos. But with our good friend the Mega Buster, this is going to be no problem. Okay, I gotta take him out. You're dead. Now let's go rescue Sophie. Let's also give her an orange juice because she got hit by a truck. And we'll take her back to the safe house. Here. I should drink up too. Um, yeah. You'll be required to hold her hand because you won't be able to give her any weapons. But usually those who hold your hand can at least stay close. Oh, um, I need to this real quick because a survivor is defenseless and if you give him a weapon, he's confident. This is my destiny to defeat you! Oh! Oh, B! It's B-Man! Ha! Huh. And now I'll get the power of a bee! Wonder what power that be- eh, he'll probably just shoot stingers or something. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, if you stomp a bee, zombies' heads will explode. Remember this! Yes, that's a dead bee. Or is it a wasp? I tend not to care. Also at night, the thing I just stepped on, larva, they will become, they will start to glow green and cause a muck. A fucking riot. So you gotta be careful. There's also, you can actually get three queens in this area. Okay, you go over there. I'll be right back. I'm just going to gather all three of the queens. So you stay right there and be a good lass. There's one at the elevator. There's one right here. Um, To be honest, I would, if you've played the game before, or if you have enough slots in your first playthrough through leveling up, 
I suggest you start catching as many queens as possible. I cannot stress this enough because of what's going to happen later in the game. So collect as many queens as you possibly can that won't clutter your inventory like fuck. And the, here is our third queen. Now, let's go back to Sophie and get her into the safe house. Knee drop so that way I don't suffer any fall damage. Go me. Alright. Now let's get the other two Nimrods here and let's call it... Come on. Well, three, Come on. two Nimrods and a mother. And I guess we'll call it an episode. Come on. Um... Yeah, the rest of the survivors will probably be fast forward here, unless I say otherwise. So, yes, we saved you. You never got to tell him how you felt. That sucks. You're 25. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's you're that guy was you were 25 and that guy was like what? Somewhere in his 40s, maybe 50, because of his male pattern baldness. Baldy, baldy. Anyways, um. The other three survivors are in the Alfresca Plaza. So, you know what? I'm just gonna cut. I'll cut to the Alfresca Plaza and I'll see you guys in a second. Hang on. Ooh, I hope, oh good, I didn't hit them. Come on, break. Break! Ah, fuck this. Uh, break! Ah! Uh, Jesus! Basically, this guy will attack us. Defend yourself. Mortal combat. Fight! Do 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 do. Okay, he's done. Anyways, start talking to him, and you'll be able to get him and that that chicken shit over there to join your party. And as you can tell, there's a woman crying somewhere, so there will be a third survivor, as I stated, a mother. Here, take this bat. I said take the bat. Take the bat. Take. Okay, fine. Take that bat. No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to eat the cookies. Come on, come on, follow me. Now those survivors will be fine if there isn't a lot of zombies to harass them. If they, there's barely any zombies, they shouldn't go out of their way to bother. So I'm just gonna tell them to stay right there. No, you zombies get away. You zombies get away. Get away. While I go commute with this lady. That's right. You be good boys. Hello, lady. You alright? Everything okay? You're Oh, God! Get off me! This is so not my destiny! This is so not my destiny! Get off! I said get off, woman! Fucking people. I can understand. I can now start to sympathize with people on why they don't really save people. What's up? Your kid? Oh, your baby? A baby in a zombie outbreak? Oh, hell no. I'll help you find it. What's wrong? Oh, zombies eating babies. That's not good. Uh, whew, whew, this is a touchy subject. Oh, look on the bright side. At least it wasn't Elmo. Elmo would have left more of a mess. 